east, which is this way, or west. Now check out the compass. Where's it pointing to when we're going this way? West, right? All the way around, it's pointing west. And you can look it up yourself. We can only circumnavigate the earth from east to west. Nobody ever in history has ever circumnavigated the earth north to south. Which means if you start here in the North Pole, you cannot circumnavigate around back to the North Pole by going flying over the south. Because there is no south. That's They don't want you to know that. So that's why it's called no fly zones. And you're not allowed to circumnavigate over what they call Antarctica, which is not really Antarctica. It's an ice wall and it ends there. And that's why they banned you from flying over it. Because they'll know, you'll know once you get there, you can't fly over it. I mean, it's really, really common sense. Now, pay attention as we turn the flat earth map into a globe. Pay attention to the continents. They are still positioned north, east, west, and south. And take a look at the ice wall. What's it become when you turn it into a bowl? It becomes the Antarctica. And if you'll notice, it's south of all the continents, just like the ice wall is south of all the continents on the flat earth map. And therefore, you cannot tell the difference. The only reason that you believe what you believe is because that's what you have been taught to believe without questioning it. Now, uh, this is not something new. You know, this is, everyone has known this for 5,000 years, all ancient civilizations, all the way up, I mean, this map is 1892. It says, scientifically and practically correct. This is not something new. This has always been like this. And then the last 100 years, with these fake government agencies, especially NASA in the last 50 years, has convinced you otherwise. Now look, even the ice wall itself is named all the way around it. Now all of a sudden that we live on a globe, all those places are gone, they don't exist anymore. Well, how did they exist in 1892, but they don't exist now? And as you can see right here on the map, it says Antarctic Circle. It doesn't say Antarctic Continent because it's a circle of ice that surrounds the earth and holds all of the oceans in. So anyways, that is how you circumnavigate on a flat earth. Uh, it's really, really simple. Thanks for watching and God bless.